how is everyone? I hope you're all well. So there are now new videos starting to emerge with regards to the Summer Wells case, and particularly looking at the search that happened up at Ben Hill Road in the early sort of the early time following Summer's disappearance. And this is something that I've heard before. This isn't new information to me, but obviously it's now been pushed onto the platform once again and that is with regards to the barrels there was apparently some 45 55 gallon drums up on the property now law enforcement were apparently told to search the property which that was done vigorously i'm sure um, but they were told not to check these barrels now apparently the the uppers had said search the whole place but then the downers that's what we'll now start calling Ronnie Lawson, the downer. Because that's all he seems to put on this case, a fucking downer. Not to search these barrels. Now, it would appear that the excuse being used is that there was a potential for these barrels to have been being used for human waste due to the redundant poo facility on that property. You know, the... Um, the septic system was null and void, if you like, whether it was broken or whether there just wasn't one, who knows. But um, we've always questioned this, haven't we? That We've always questioned what was searched, when was searched. We still don't know if the septic systems around this property were indeed searched. I certainly have not seen a clear answer to that. But summer went somewhere she disappeared off the face of the bloody planet and now we've got a situation of saying that that search that took place potentially wasn't a thorough search wasn't thorough at all and those barrels had subsequently been removed from the property so who removed them from the property for a start and if we're saying that at the point when a little girl was on the property and then vanished and then you didn't search some things that could have facilitated that removal. This could be why Don Wells is so sure that Summer won't get found and why Candace was so adamant that she knew that Summer was no longer at 110 Ben Hill Road. Two statements that these parents have both said. How did she get off of Ben Hill Road? If she ended up back there after swimming how did she get off the property did candace take her off the property because it would appear that don wells never came to the property before law enforcement came back until after the 911 call was made so now so if she went during that day then candace definitely would have been the one to take her off unless someone wandered off and got caught by someone else but this is a big focus area. This is how did Summer get off of 110 Ben Hill Road? Was she indeed put into something and removed later because law enforcement failed to do their job when they had a chance to? Would the sniffer dogs have been able to sniff what they needed to if Summer had indeed been in one of them barrels? And I know it was a horrendous thing to think about absolutely horrendous but i'm not sure i could put anything past this this family you know if, if something's happened what lengths would they have truly gone to hide what they needed to hide you tell me and i'll catch you all in the next one